Hello everyone, today I will introduce the general maintenance of Mobi i700. Detector calibration. When the machine is used for a period of time, there will be some image artifacts or image quality is significantly reduced. The detector calibration is required. Detector calibration steps are as follows. Switch on the machine and push it onto the shooting room. Adjust the position of the machine. Put the detector on a horizontal desktop. There's no objects on the detector's surface. Move the tube to the upside of the detector. Switch on the kilometer lamp. Align the line field across line of the kilometer to the detector cross line. Pull out the kilometer tape. Adjust the distance from the kilometer to the surface of the detector is 1.3 meters. Adjustment of kilometer line field to maximum. Make sure light field is completely cover the detector. Click emergency in the patient interface. Enter the exam interface. Click the radiation icon in the upper right corner to enter the delayed exposure setup interface. Cancel the delayed exposure function of the hand switch. Click Close. Click the System Configuration icon in the upper left corner to enter the system configuration. Click Detector Calibration. Click Start Calibration, pop up the warning screen. Click OK, pop up the Delay Exposure Setup screen. Please set up enough time for the operator to leave the shooting room safely. Detector calibration is full automatic calibration, so please bind the hand switch during calibration. Tape binding hand switch is available. Make it the first and the second grace press simultaneously. Click start to make the countdown start. After that, please leave the shooting room and close the shooting door quickly. The calibration process can be observed from the lead glass. When the calibration successful information appears in the interface, indicate the calibration is complete. At this time, the hand switch can be released. Detect the calibration complete. Click Exit Calibration. Automatic delete, backup and recovery from patient data. When the machine warning the hard disk space is not enough after use a period of time, we can set up image delete method or delete unnecessary image after backup the images. Setting up image delete method. Click the disk space icon at the bottom right of the touch screen. The disk space configuration window is displayed. Select image delete methods are required. Backup images. Insert the USB flash disk or mobile hard disk. Click History at the bottom of the touch screen. Select Patient and click Backup. Enter in the Backup Patient interface. Note, if select Delete the local image after backup, the image will be deleted. Click Backup to start. The progress can be viewed in Task Manager. Take out the USB drive after backup. Note, only the patients that have been examined can be backed up. If the patient has not completed yet, the backup will be filled. At that time, it needs to close the patient on the wheel interface before backing up the patient. Restore image. Insert a USB flash disk with the backup image into the machine. Click History. Select data source in the upper right corner as backup data, USB. Select a patient and click Restore. Click Yes to start. The restoration progress will be in the task manager. After recovery, take out the USB flash disk. Adjust the spring balance force of the stand column. When the machine is used for a period of time, the tube assembly may not be in an unbalanced state. For example, the tube assembly would drop automatically after unlocking. 
In this case, it is necessary to adjust the spring balance force in the column. The maintenance steps are as follows. Remove the screw decorative cap. Removing the lower cover of the column with a cross screwdriver. Removing the rear cover of the column base. Hold the folding arm handle. Rotate the column to move the adjusting hole to the position convenient for adjustment. Then move the adjusting hole stopper. Use an 8mm Allen wrench to adjust the screws clockwise. Clockwise rotating. The forces of spring increased. Counterclockwise rotating. The forces of spring decreased. The tube assembly can be operated at the same time during adjustment. Make sure that the upward and the downward motion is smooth. After the adjustment, install the removed parts one by one. Adjust the spring balance force of the folding arm. When the machine is used for a period of time, the swimming motion of the folding arm may be unbalanced. For example, the folding arm automatically expands after unlocking. In this case, it is required to adjust the spring balance force inside the folding arm. The maintenance steps are as follows. Retract the folding arm to the vertical position. Hold the handle of the horizontal arm. Turn the swim arm aside. Turn the folding arm to 90 degrees. Open the end cover of the folding arm. Use a 2mm Allen wrench to loosen the lock screw. Then expand the folding arm to horizontal state. Adjust the spring of folding arm clockwise with 70mm sleeve. Clockwise rotating. The spring forces increased. Counterclockwise rotating. The spring forces decreased. The folding arm can be operated at the same time during adjustment. Make the movement of expand and the retracting smooth. After adjustment, install the removed parts one by one. In particular, tighten the lock screw. These are the main content of Mobi i700 general maintenance. If you have any questions, please contact MindJ customer service.